So we have seen a lot of change over the years in North Hills. This right here is Sky 5's view of the indoor mall. This was here more than 20 years ago. And then look at how this compares to Drone 5 video that we shot earlier today. So much development is already finished and a lot more is on the way. Yeah, things are changing. We got a ground level view also of the area's future. WRL's Matt Tallhelm joining us live from North Hills with an up close look you'll only see here on WRL. Matt. Yeah, Dan and Lena, all of this latest construction is happening on top of what was the J.C. Penney department store here. We talked with developer John Kane, who's behind all this, about the future here of North Hills and another massive new development on the south side of the city. 20 years after a bulldozer began ripping down the North Hills Mall, construction crews are celebrating the completion of the steel, concrete, and glass skeletons of the newest buildings to rise from the rubble. This is the largest project that we've ever undertaken, about $350 million. John Kane is the developer behind the mall's transformation. Getting residential on this side of the street, on the, where the old mall was, is really important to us, and getting more uh, office on top of retail here is very important, because we've been mostly a retail kind of an operation here. Kane's team took us on a tour of the construction site, and to the top of the new 10-story 1 North Hills. The glass office tower overlooks the Beltline on one side and a five-story office building under construction above new shops and restaurants on the other. We want to make sure that all of North Hills gets to enjoy this as their view. This is what that terrace view will look like when the offices and a 12-story apartment building open here. It's just community. Like, all we ever do is try to build community for everyone, anyone, anyone that wants to come enjoy it. Kane wants to continue building up North Hills, a Zoning to allow for taller towers has been on hold since four new members joined city council in December. For this case being a case that's been around for well over a year, we're trying to kind of get give them some time to get their legs under them and get comfortable with that. Kane is getting ready to break ground on the massive new downtown south development. It will bring an apartment tower, offices, shops, and an entertainment venue along South Saunders Street at I-40. Eventually, I think that will be comparable to North Hills. It'll have a different flavor to it and a different feel to it because we're trying to do something they're very very different than what we've done here and here at north hills kane says that that rezoning he may wait a little bit longer it's supposed to go back to city council in just about two weeks but because so many of those councilors are new he says may hold off push that back a little bit the downtown south development we may start seeing construction start there he says soon with the first building starting to go up by the summer Keep us updated. Matt Tallhelm in North Hills. Thanks, Matt.